Hey, what's going on guys? So this is going to be an updated deck profile on the Future Fusion Lightsworn deck that I was playing. And so yeah, I think this deck uh, you know, has some potential really, and uh, I'm still working on it so it's not like complete yet. But you're welcome to test it out and let me know what you guys think. But uh, yeah, let me go ahead and show you what I changed. So I decided to drop the duality. Uh, we're running only one duality instead of two. And we're playing triple gold Sark now, uh, just because Future Fusion really makes this deck so much more viable. And uh, also, Dragon's Mirror is uh, also a new addition that I put it in here. And we removed the Tour Guide uh, engine, and then we decided to put in Eclipse Wyverns because I felt um, if you're able to just go first turn Future Fusion plus uh, Dragon's Mirror, you have such a good setup. And uh, I'll explain that. So basically, you Future Fusion, most likely these are going to be the cards you want to send to the grave. You could opt to send uh, Graganeth, the Lightsworn Dragon, just for the Lightsworn name. But if you're going to activate Dragon's Mirror, you probably don't want to remove the Lightsworn names. Um, so yeah, just take that into consideration, but yeah, so you can banish, uh, all these cards after a future fusion, and Eclipse Wyvern's effect will activate, so then you can add triple Judgment Dragon, so I mean, think of this, guys, you get to send a whole bunch of cards to your graveyard, and then add three Judgment Dragon to your hand, that seems pretty unfair to me, um, but, uh, most likely you, I usually go for two, uh, Judgment Dragons, and then one Red Ice Darkness Metal, although there isn't something summonable, uh, I mean, there's no dragon on the field to get it out, unless you have Lumina. And so, Lumina, uh, discard a card, get back Lumina, and then you can basically make a, a you know, any, uh, level 3 that you want, uh, ex uh, exceed. And that most likely will be Leviathan Dragon, just because you can remove it for Red Eyes Darkness Metal. And then you can get back, perhaps, another dragon. I mean, you can get back Dragoneth, which isn't, you know, too good, but most likely the, uh, the card you'll be getting out is Light Pulsar. But yeah, I still feel like there needs to be a, a, a dragon in here. I was thinking about Mass Dragon. Let me know what you guys think of that. I know Mass Dragon isn't like light or dark, but uh, the thing is with Mass Dragon, you can Mass Dragon into Mass Dragon, and then you can banish it to Special Summon Red Eyes Darkness Metal, and then get back the uh, Mass Dragon that got out the other Mass Dragon, if that makes sense to you guys. Um, also, a new addition here, I did put in a Reasoning, uh, just because I thought this card was interesting in the deck because there's so many different levels. I mean, generally people will call level 4. I'd say that that still is... Uh, the best thing to a call with reasoning because it's the most common uh, monster. But I mean, you can get out stuff like Light Pulsar, you can get out uh, Gragoneth. Uh, no one will ever call level 10 though, so if you haven't hit Red Eyes Director's Metal, you'll probably get that out no problem. And as well as it allows you to mill some cards as well. And during the process, um, I believe you can still get Wolf because it's still uh, sent to the graveyard. So, I mean, there is only one Wolf in here just because I felt like you can kind of clog because there's a lot of big monsters in here. Uh, but yeah, Future Fusion really does help out the deck, and I felt like uh, Triple Gold Sark would really enable you to uh, get out whatever combo you need. Like, um, And as well as, you should probably be running two of these five-headed dragons. I have two right here, and that's because uh, you have one that you can possibly get out with Future Fusion, and then you have another one which you can get out with Dragons in here. So yeah, let me know what you guys think of this deck. Uh, I'm still running three Interplanetary Purpley Thorny. It's just, this is the most common combo that you want to send to the graveyard with Future Fusion. But, uh, I mean... Depending on what you have, that can change, uh, depending on what you have in your hand. But yeah, let me know what you guys think of this, and I'm still working on it, and I'll be making an updated version later on, but uh, it definitely seems like it has potential, because Future Fusion plus that is pretty darn good. I mean, you get to add three Judgment Dragon to your hand if you want, and get a 5,000 beater first turn, and like deck them by a lot, so definitely uh, something, you know, that could be uh, seen in the future as meta. Uh, but anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Asianized White Dragon, signing out.